Guam people dems, welcome to my channel and welcome to room 2703 reacts and um, so this is uh, a dive into Mr. Dimash so I'm really excited to uh, watch this because this is one that has been recommended a lot as well um, particularly the Ar Arno performance more so so that's what I've got on here and actually this one I think has got the English subtitles on it as well whereas the other one that I clicked on which is to be fair the one that had like millions of views didn't seem to have any English subtitles yeah I'm quite keen to get into this one and see what it's saying so yes let's waste no time this is Mr. Dimash and Alimpico This is probably what I feel like is probably um, the most up tempo ish type of tune I think I've heard him do. And actually, it's really interesting to hear like a mesh between, again, what I saw class operatic, <laughs> that type of vocal skill set and a tune like that that is that seems a little bit more secular. Um, like, whereas the others have felt a lot more ballady um, in just its whole entirety. Apart from Diva Dance, Master with Confessor, um, this one feels a lot more like. Like, it's, a, it's, a, it's got more of, a, of that punch to it. And actually, it's really interesting to hear that type of vocal against a, a backdrop of a tune like that. I love the message of the song, you know, being like the world, the world wants you, I mean, you can get it if you can. And then that switch up between where he was at and then the when he just took it up, like, I'm like, wow. <laughs> so yeah, I'm intrigued to find out where he goes with the, with the next half of this song, but okay, this is sick. I'm loving like the setup as well. Like I'm in purple, my favorite color. So like all the purple and stuff, like, the jacket he's got on, like I love that little Michael Jackson lean that he did there on the side. <laughs> yeah, I love it.
Dude. 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 I <laughs> okay, I gotta be honest here. Like, we're in that first half. First, you know when you just don't hear a song first, you just don't know how to, you don't have to catch it. You don't have to, have to, have to kind of catch, catch where you're at with the song. Like, so I was like, okay, this is, this is, this is uh, like, in terms of like his ability and what he's doing, cool, like cool, like really, really cool. Like I, I know he's got that big voice and whatever. Then he switched it up and and and, and I was like, wow. Then then broke for the for the middle. But you see that second half, because I'd kind of had enough time then to kind of understand the, the tune a bit, like and where it was gulping or da 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 da. Like, I was able to kind of embed in the atmosphere of it all. Like, I, well, that's the only thing I can think of because but that second half. <laughs> incredible that was absolutely <laughs> incredible do you know what's really bizarre to me as well is that like because he's got like these eight different voices in the one body right when you look at him like he's just this like, very meek like again mild looking young guy do you know what I mean like um you know he's not the biggest of guys in the world either like you know but he's got this presence and it's like when he opens his mouth it's just completely different as to what you see with his politeness and his thank you and and you know, like it's completely different like pop that poise and the where he's standing and how he's standing and then how he brings in look that bit in the second part was like the again like not that a male can't sound like a female but it was it was literally like a female had turned around and was like that's my part and it was just it, but it was such a switch and so it just kept going up and up and up and up wow i don't know <laughs> anymore about this guy i'm like okay i'll probably you know i'm probably not gonna say another one that's gonna shock me that much really um you know i'm probably as shocked because the thing is and for someone that like i don't know might doubt reactions or might have just come here at summer for the first time like like i have seen this person before like i've seen this guy sing before now um but like now i'm like what well, i'm only like what maybe five songs in I'm like, I'm like five songs into him so i know i know i know what he can do well i said i know what he can do <laughs> let let me just correct myself before y'all correct me <laughs> about you know what you can do newbie about you know what you can do <laughs> you better recognize <laughs> oh yeah i don't necessarily know all of what he can do but i've got an idea now of what he brings to the table right so you can imagine you're like well if you kind of know what he's going to bring to the table how can you be so shocked but i think it's for me it's it's you never, you, to, as well, I can only speak for myself anyway, but you never stop being shocked at someone's ability to be able to do something like that. I don't think you ever stop being shocked. And when you see it being deployed in lots of different ways, in, you know, in songs that you've never heard before either, so you just don't know what's coming. You don't know how that song is going to be performed. You don't know how that song is going to be initiated. You don't know what melody is coming. You don't know what the stage is going to do. You don't know what pauses, what breaks, whatever. You don't know, you don't know what that skill set that he's got, you don't know how it's going to show up in this next performance. So I think that's the thing that is like, is always so shocking to me that you don't know what's coming. And I know there's people already that have said in the comments, like, even though they've been watching him for years, they are still in awe of him when he opens his mouth. Because you, you don't you don't just see that one day and go, oh, okay, old hat now. Do you know what I mean? Like, because it's something, something I... When do you see that in day-to-day -day life? In day-to-day -day life, when do you see someone that's able to... Con to encompass so many different personas and voices and and intonations and tonalities. How many how, how often do you see that in just day to day? When I'm watching Top of the Pops, I ain't seen none of that. When I'm listening to um, Kiss FM, I ain't seen none of that. When I'm listening to or watching any of the videos that I watch on YouTube, I'm not seeing that. So for me, like it is mind boggling when I see that. Like and I and I, and I can't. I, can't, I cannot contain my absolute just delight and shock. <laughs> my delight and shock. It's amazing. Absolutely amazing. So, yeah. Wow. Wow. This is only meant to be a few little, 
few little videos I'm gonna do, just like a few little ones, get into my shows later, but now I just wanna watch more. <laughs> but I won't though, because it's nice to kind of pace these out. So yeah, thank you for watching that. Wow, I really enjoyed that. I really enjoyed that. And I think why I'm so like happy with that as well is that like as I said, a little a little a little bit through the first bit, I was like, I wonder if it's gonna be one that I don't enjoy as much, do you know what I mean? Like cool still, do you know what I mean? But maybe maybe I don't enjoy it as much, but yo, what's I, I need to just get them thoughts out of my head. Like, do you know what I mean? Like, I feel like I'm going to enjoy every single one that he does because he does. He ain't he ain't putting on no no bad performance. Do you know what I mean? That's that's not in his repertoire. <laughs> yeah, wow, amazing, 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 amazing. So yeah, thank you for watching that with me. I hope you enjoyed that. Again, if you if you could give me a like and subscribe, that'd be amazing. I've also set up a Patreon as well, like, so which will help the channel, help support me to make more content for you guys. Um, so if you do want to head over there and show some love i would massively appreciate it but also no pressure you, you do you boo you do you boo <laughs> and uh, yeah hopefully i'll see you on the next one <laughs>